Hi. It was chilling, not in a relaxed sense, to observe an animated man, ha Matt Hancock, Health Secretary, bringing tidings of joy about the rolling out of the vaccine. After an unending catalogue of broken, triumphant announcements, it will be over by Easter, they proclaim. The misinformed lied to public for the continuous stream of contradictory statements are falling for the latest outpouring of media and governmental falsehoods. <clears throat> Apart from the growing number of COVID deniers, but that's another irrationality, there's something behind these premature celebrations. The government are desperate for us to indulge in an orgy of pre-Christmas consumerism, boosting the Mickey Mouse economy already doomed in the C-19 fallout. With the pre- and post-Christmas shopping frenzy, New Year celebrations, millions ignoring social distances, we're being set up for escalating mortality figures, leading to the inevitable lockdown free. Of course, government mouthpieces will heap blame on the gullible public after urging them into a bacchanalian month of backslapping, self-congratulation, shopping, flag-waving patriotism, Brexit being weeks away. Already, huge queues of eager consumers are forming. Far less people are bothering with masks on public transport. They think it's all over, but it ain't by a long shot. In a month, we're going to enter the long hangover. Irony is the Tory regime will be riding high on their euphoric Brexit conclusion, still ahead in the polls. None of the accumulating mountain of problems is going away. So 2021 should hopefully see the opening shots of the revolutionary decade. Bye.